three, two, one, go! And off, this field of over a hundred riders. The one that looks like the end of this field of all that is a yellow gold penguin signed by Gladiator Taylor for about $2,000. Some riders looking around, they're going to have some two lights around in the early state. It's back when we last saw him, but it's now 95. Believe in that group, Anton Barabelle. He's introduced to you prior to the start. Man. Well, you know, Steve, I would say it's up to the Kelly Benefit Strategy Group to, uh, there's two of them, they should put one of those guys in the front and put it back. Uh, but that's really going to raise the sword up amongst themselves. Chris uh, Rob is just going to put his head down and work. Look at that face on him, he's just working. For nine races in the BC Super Week, only one to go. That's the Tour de White Rock, of course, but $105,000 in prize money. It's a lot on the line for the pros here. Uh, it's number 13 lead through Scott Rizansky and someone else moving on the outside of him to take charge of things right now. So we've got a group of nine riders together out there. Someone else on the far right uh, is going uh, out on the outside in the red and black suit. Looks as though that be number 137. So, and our late guy is getting into the red. That's the immediately leave the course as we're coming up to the end of lap 29. There it is. That's the nine laps left. And it looks like pretty much the whole group is back together. Here's another counterattack yet again from the Pure Black Racing Score. This time covered by one of the HR World Riders. Put your hands together, ladies and gentlemen. This is for all the marbles. This is for the 2012 Giro de Fernami. As the red vehicle goes past, and here comes the train to the right. Who's going to take first, second? Don't worry, you got some. In victory, it is number 20. That is Ken Hansen. Back to back victories. Ken Hansen, number 20. in the sprint. What was, uh, what was the race like? Were you saving yourself for the for the end? It seemed like Kelly uh, Benefit Strategies had the numbers. What was your strategy going to the risk? Well, you know, we uh, we had two guys in that breakaway uh, early on, and, um, you know, we knew if it came down to a sprint, um, you know, we were pretty confident in that. But, I mean, you know, still, it's uh, it's never guaranteed until they cross the line first. But um, the guys just did a, did a good job the last couple laps just keep me in the front out of trouble. And then, uh, you know, like last night, Alex Candelario just gave me the perfect lead out, and uh, I was able to finish it off. That's right. Tell me what happened in that lead. group. I don't know if you had a chance to talk to your... Uh, to your teammates at all. I mean, it seemed like it was the right mix. You guys had two guys in the break. Uh, you had representation from Orca Green Edge. Uh, it seemed like it was going to work, but it didn't seem to be like very much organization. Any insight to that at all? Uh, I don't know. I mean, uh, you know, it was, a, it was a big enough group. Sometimes when they're that big, um, you get uh, some guys that don't maybe want to contribute to the work, and then um, it disrupts the rhythm. But um, yeah, I don't know. I wasn't in there, so I couldn't tell you. But uh, you know, we would have been fine with that staying away. You know, but. Um, you know, if, uh, certainly if we came back to a sprint, we were gonna we were gonna play the card as well. How did it all come back together? Oh, truthfully, I was just hoping it goes away because I was just really struggling tonight. So I felt like I was riding in quicksand a little bit. So I'm absolutely wrapped to be in third. We've come up from Utah and Alabama and Colorado. Last year I came on my own, and there's just a great community supporting BC Super Week. So that's one of my favorite races of the whole year. Yeah, I think uh, just the nature of the group is, is quite big and uh, guys definitely weren't going to let me go or weren't going to work with me, so uh, yeah, I just decided it's one of those deals to go back to the group and see if we can switch the order of it. There we go, so watch out the year. <laughs> 2012 Giro Fraternity, and thanks to our Giro Heroes of 200 volunteers, incredible sponsors.